I guess we're in trouble. They are currently looking at the footage. Footage of me doing 200 miles an hour. I'm, I'm fucked. Twenty-seven. How's your night? You have a good night. Hey, hey, my night is uh, bueno, bueno, bueno. It's too hot, you know. Switzerland. <laughs> I swear, you know, all night I'm like trying to talk to chica. I get too close and she feels she's like, oh, you, you kind of wet, man. What's wrong with you? I see you, Mayana. Eh? We gotta drive to fucking Turin or something. I don't know. It's fucking Italy. I know want to drink so much, man. Fuck these kids, they make me drunk, man! <laughs> Bonjour. Yeah. So in Switzerland. Bonjour. Guys, I'm so sorry for everyone that wanted to meet up in Geneva this morning. I know I told you guys 10 in the morning, but it's 5.30 and we're just now leaving. I was so drunk last night. Mark witnessed it, unfortunately. I stumbled into the hotel room. Uh, I got so drunk. I, I was like a 16 year old with a fake ID at a club for the very first time. We were drinking out of the bottle. It was just insane. I was, I was so drunk that I was singing along to the lyrics of Titanium by David Guetta. So we're headed over to Monaco. We're with Mr. Cars and Coffee and his 458 Special. And uh, Tazzy Baby with her AMG GT, which Mark now wants to get, which is pretty cool. All fueled up, fun fact about Switzerland, not sure if I said, you pump first and then you pay. That's pretty cool, huh? So we pump your car, now we gotta go pay. Is this a show or what? Right? Yes. Uh, uh, car and driver, top gear, fifth gear. I know. Okay. Yours was so cheap 38 francs for your diesel. How, how much was mine? Mine was 150 francs. 150. 150 francs? Yeah. So like 170 bucks. Do you want to talk to them while I pee? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I'm going to pee, guys. All right, go pee. Enjoy. Oh, I need some coffee. I need to wake up. Okay. Iced coffee is macchiato. Really weird, huh? It's supposed to be hot coffee in these cups, but it's iced coffee. Uh, who's holding the camera? You guys want me? Uh, you know what, I don't think anyone wants footage of the Volvo. Let's go with the Lambo. into another toll road. French, why do you guys steal your people's money with these toll roads? It's unbelievable. And they're expensive too. Every like 40 miles, you gotta pay 20 euros. It adds up on a 6,000 mile trip. It's the only way I can pay 
60, 180 poles. Man, this thing screams. <laughs> I hope the GoPro picked up the audio. Otherwise, I gotta, I gotta deal with this one-handed. Which... Look at that! Unbelievable. Best way, the best way to experience Europe: drive through it. I've flown into Europe, so I've never seen this. You know, I've always driven within the city. All I've had are, are uh, rental cars that I've driven in the city. So I've never experienced the outskirts and. epic place in the world you gotta preserve our planet guys you gotta preserve our planet I, I know it sounds weird coming from a guy that has uh you know straight pipe b12s but fucking a i'm, I'm buying a hybrid <laughs> i have to wear as a daily look at this landscape we got a tunnel we got mont blanc oh unreal all right guys you want to talk about a tunnel Let's see how long this tunnel is. All right, so this is a Mont Blanc tunnel. You gotta pay, you gotta get your pass. I currently have 699.6 miles on this Euro trip. So let's call it 699 miles. So that's been about half a mile since I entered. Let's see how long this tunnel is. I mean, I, I can't even see the end. Look at that, I can't even see the end of it. The speed cameras and all that crap here, but who gives a shit, eh? What are you gonna do? Send me a ticket to California? Yeah, you probably will. Uh, ban me from Europe. That would suck. So I gotta pay those for sure. So far, it's been a mile. <laughs> it echoes differently in this tunnel. This isn't like the Van Nuys tunnel that I always grip through going to AGX. It's so long and just two lanes. I, just, I hope the camera picks up. I mean, you hear everything. Listen. This little rest that it has at 3,000 RPMs. Listen to this. Here, let me change gears. That's how long this tunnel is, that there's a fire station in here. Looks like 
like it's about another half mile. It's a six and a half mile tunnel. The only thing that sucks, speed cameras, and you have to keep 150 meter distance. So uh, that's all the blue lights you guys have been seeing. Those are the distance markers. So you have to be one blue light behind the other person. Unbelievable, okay? The official count, six, 0.4 miles. Look, and I wasn't even kidding about the fire. See that? Fire, <laughs> fire station here. Fire trucks. That's crazy. That is that is a mountain. Absolutely epic. Uh oh. Stop. That way. I'm sorry, sir. Uh, you vedi i segnali? Ti faccio parlare italiano. Ti faccio l'alta, ti devi fermare. Okay. Okay, I guess we're in trouble. Fuck. Definitely in trouble here. Alright, I gotta turn the camera off. This is fucked. stopped right here me mark the ferrari uh they took my uh, they took my camera and my gopro so they are currently looking at the footage footage of me doing 200 miles an hour so uh i'm, I'm fucked they're uh, waiting for the french police to come because i did it on the french side so uh I, I I don't know what to what to expect right now, so we will uh, we'll see. I'm, I'm recording this on my cell phone. I have my cell phone in the car, so uh, this might be my my goodbye video to you guys. Might be uh, spending some nights in the European jail, so uh, yeah, I'll see. Alright dudes, uh, update, they took my GoPro, my camera, let me roll this up for you guys, obviously we're in the Ferrari, I'm no longer allowed to drive in Italy, so Francesco, the owner of the Ferrari, Mr. Cars and Coffee, is driving my Mercilago over there, his girlfriend is driving the Volvo, and Mark is allowed to drive in Italy, I guess it's because of his last name, huh? It's so, uh, Jesus, another tunnel. They saw the cameras, they asked for it. By the time he went around, I took out the SD card of my main camera. I slid it in the driver's seat. So I have that card. But the GoPro, the guys, uh, they couldn't use it. And uh, what he kept saying is, I need to see the footage. I need the footage deleted. He said deleted. But then he said, I need to see the footage. So I'm thinking, okay, if he sees the footage, he's gonna see me doing 200 miles an hour, I'm gonna get absolutely screwed, right? So because he had said I need it deleted, obviously he can't read what I'm doing, so I swiped and uh, I formatted the SD card and I told him, okay, delete, no media. He says, no, 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 I, I need to see the, I said, oh, I'm sorry, I, I deleted the footage. So the GoPro footage is deleted. Mark says maybe he can uh, recover. recover it. Which I hope he does because our Switzerland footage yes, our is all on there. Yep. So otherwise, I don't know, that Switzerland vlog is, is gonna suck, but uh, it is what it is. So we 
we got away unscathed and just paid a lot of fines paid uh about a thousand euro a little between the two of us we paid a thousand euro paid a thousand euro so it, not happy not yeah uh, not happy but uh it's okay so i told them so the reason why we got pulled over is because i overtook and we were speeding so i told them i only overtook to catch up to the ferrari because i'm a tourist i'm not from here i didn't want to get lost i'm following him we've been driving since geneva so they understood and very very nice cops i have to say everything i've heard about you know french cops is untrue the french police that came out uh very you know he, he looked at the side of the car saw Mondi. he looked it up on youtube and i watched him press subscribe <laughs> yes so he's probably gonna see this footage so when you see this footage i you know i want to thank you for being a you know a true gentleman a uh, officer of the law and being so kind i i screwed up i paid the fine it's my mistake uh thank you for being nice about it the italian cops too at first uh hand on the gun I didn't understand you was telling me go left, go right, so but uh he came and he approached me with a hand on the gun, but afterwards the Italian police officers were very very nice. The funny thing though, they took a picture with the Ferrari and now with the Lamborghini. And I asked, I said, You don't want to take a picture with this? He said, No, for me, only Ferrari. Lamborghini, it's Audi, it's not Italian. He said Lamborghini only exists because of Ferrari. Which was really cool. To the Italian officer, if you're watching this, the only reason I hit the other camera card is because I had a lot of footage from three days uh, in Barcelona, in Swi uh, Switzerland, so and uh, in France. I didn't want to lose that footage. You know, I'm, I'm debating between an Aston Martin uh, A12 and this for the FF replacement. This really Ferrari, Ferrari. But you would get this over the A12? Um, no, A12. A12 over this, yes. Okay, uh, Mark has decided what car I'm getting next. I have. So don't Sorry. comment below. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> comment below. Mark, what do you think of Europe bro, so far? I, it is the landscape here. The most beautiful place on earth. Scotland. <laughs> Francesca, Francesco, you have a phone on my car. I love it. Floor it. <laughs> oh. Is that enough? That was the fastest I've ever run in my life. Really? Yes. What, what was your speed? I saw 260 and I let go. 260? Yes. What's the fastest you've ever gone? Uh, well, in miles? Yes. Like 130. 130? So, 130 is about two, uh, 220. Oh, okay. So, you went 260? Yes. Which is about 150. Uh, one, 155. <laughs> Francesco, how was that? 
it's amazing. Yeah. It's unbelievable. Oh God. my God, it's so love of you, dude. It's so amazing. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's, that's <laughs> thank you too. Thank oh, you yeah. so much. It's amazing. I mean, the, the thing of the manual yeah. and the thing of the, you know, the sound, it's a crazy mix. The car is unbelievable. I would, I would take it now. Okay, let's go, let's drive. You want to trade? <laughs> Oh my, you should have seen that the flame was like yeah, that really? big. Oh my god, yeah. yeah. You gotta get it hot, yeah. and then at 6,000 RPMs let go, shoots a massive flame. Yeah, really, but it's so nice to drive. I think uh, I need to pump air in this tire. Yeah. So as I'm filling air in the tires over here, I see this, I'm like, wow, these courses are so sticky. And I keep looking, and look at that. See if I can find it. Look at that nail. See that nail right there? Ha! Look at that. I feel like I'm surrounded in like a dome. I'm just surrounded by huge mountains. Like, uh, don't get me wrong, like Angeles Crest Mountains are huge, but this. Dude, is that a castle? That is a castle, right? It is a castle. Due to the police hold up, we did not make it to Monaco. We are in beautiful Turin. With Francesco, we're staying at his place. Look at this beautiful thing. Guys, if it wasn't for this man, I would be in jail. Please go follow him on Instagram. Tell him only sent me. Go thank him over there. We just had pasta instead of jail food. So <laughs> I'm counting my blessings. I'm very thankful. Uh, we will see you guys mañana where we go to Monaco. Yes? Yes. And uh, we'll be in Monaco for two days. So catch us there. That's it. Ciao. Oh, yeah. I can't, oh. I can't not do the chop, chop. Oh yeah, chop. Chop, chop.